Brad Downey. Brad Downey, born 1980 in Louisville, Kentucky, is an American artist, political activist, and filmmaker. Downey lives in Berlin. Education. Downey earned a fine art master's degree in painting and sculpture from the Slade School of Art, where he studied under Bruce McLean. He grew up in a United States Marine Corps family. Pratt Institute drew him to New York City in 1998, where he earned a Bachelor of Fine Arts in Documentary Filmmaking. Work Through varied work and media, and persistent changes in direction, Brad Downey has avoided one signature visual style. Downey initially became known for transforming public signage into artworks, which he, at first anonymously, installed in public space disguised as a construction worker. His earliest motifs were sculptures of anthropomorphized street furniture dissociating from their intended function. These early works were often made in collaboration with Leon Reed Roman IV. The ephemeral nature of this early series can still be found in many of his works today. With collaborators Quenell Jones and Tim Hansberry, Downey directed Public Discourse 2003, a 38-minute documentary about graffiti and street art, which screened at numerous locations including the Institute of Contemporary Arts in London, Copenhagen International Documentary Festival, and Transmedial in Berlin. The film shows work by artists such as Swoon Shepherd Ferry, Rez, Nato, DeSat Ellen Harvey, J.J. Veronis, and Johnny Swing from the Rivington School, and features original music by Jack and Thur. Public discourse was distributed by Video Data Bank. In 2007, Downey was awarded CETA Arts Plus Award for a commission with the Tour de France. Though he completed his installation, the artwork was removed and dismantled by Kent Highway Services before its unveiling because of its potential to confuse pedestrians. In 2008, Downey sprayed green paint on the shopping windows of Berlin's historical Kadui Mall, which the owners reported to the police as an act of vandalism. However, Downey had been contracted by the Lacoste clothing brand along with 11 other artists for an exhibition at Kadui celebrating the 75th anniversary of the brand, and he maintained that he was just fulfilling his contract. Daitade Saitung speculated that the incident might have been a media stunt by Lacoste. These speculations are contradicted by the fact that after the action Lacoste kicked Brad out of the exhibition, deleted him from the press material, and never paid him what Jan Josweg from Daitade Saitung described as the fact is Kadoui and Lacoste, with their bureaucratic inflexibility cannot distinguish art from vandalism both Kadoui and Lacoste. In 2009, Downey was commissioned to paint a mural for the Liufana University of Lunenburg. His mural generated controversy because it looked exactly like an advertisement for the fast food burger chain McDonald's. Brad Downey's I'm Lovin' It mural was not intended to be a McDonald's advertisement. It was created ironically and was anticipated to serve as a critique to the change of university policy. At the time of the mural's creation, the university was undergoing a rebranding process. The advertising agency Skulls and Friends had just invented the new name Liufana and developed a new brand logo. As part of this rebranding, Liufana had started the construction of the lecture hall Central Jabod by architect Daniel Leibskind. The costs are said to add up to a 109.3 million euro. In order to avoid a public bid invitation for the building contract, Leibskind was made part-time professor at the Liufana, though he did very few lectures for the students. Daniela Kummel, one of the university students, wrote, in support of Brad's mural, an artwork that could in other contexts be read as a plain provocation acquires a deeper social and political meaning within in the recent history of this specific university. It imbibes the earlier articulated fears of critics that foresee Liufana becoming a private university serving primary. The university installed a plaque explaining the meaning of the mural. After a few years, the plaque and mural were quietly removed. In 2019, Downey orchestrated the creation of the first public sculpture of Melania Trump, 
the wife of the 45th American president Donald Trump, in her home country, Slovenia. The sculpture, which was actually designed and created by a local artisanal artist with a chainsaw, was received with mixed reactions, due in part to Downey having done no physical work on it. The statue stands in Rosno near Trump's hometown of Sebnica. The sculpture is reported to have been set on fire near her hometown in Slovenia, prompting its removal. In relation to the destruction of the piece, he has exhibited in venues such as the Museum Tingley Tate Modern, the ICA in London, and Mass Mocha in the USA Peak Up Visual Arts in Scotland, Kunstel Dominikaner Kirch in Osnabrück, Kunstzentrit Silkeborg Bad in Denmark.